The Vikings in Dallas and a fresh faced rookie trying to become the first 100 yard rusher against the Dallas defense this season. As for the Dallas offense, would you believe they have not scored a first quarter touchdown all year? That's amazing for a high powered offense like this. And Romo finds Terrell Owens to try and score that first first quarter touchdown of the year. And from third and goal, here's that first first quarter touchdown of the year. Back of the end zone, it's the least defense place on the entire field. And uh, Terrell Owens is his own towel. No, oh, yeah. Is that legal? He's selling something. There's his own towel. Next possession, Minnesota, Tavares Jackson dumps it off to Adrian. <laughs> 12 yard gain. Four plays later, it's fourth and one. Why not just do it when you got Adrian? Give it to him. <laughs> yeah, he lives close to the area. Mama, father, cousins, nephews, aunt, uncles, nieces. Everyone's at the game today. Two plays later, put my front, but this rookie is fantastic. That was too easy. Adrian Peterson runs it in. Fifth rushing touchdown of the season. We got a tie. Ball game. Look at him find the holes, bounce through there sideways. Look at the vision. Look at the strength. You cannot bring him down. Newman tried to come off a block. You cannot bring this guy down with one arm. Second quarter, first and ten for the Cowboys, right on the star. Romo hits Patrick Creighton over the middle, and he's hit. Antoine Winfield causes the fumble right to Ben Lieber, who does Pitch what? It. Pitches it to Cedric Griffin, who then proceeds to dribble, dribble the ball down the field. Hold it up! There you go, baby. <laughs> a little homage. Where did he learn that from? That's my baby. <laughs> so Ben Lieber picks it up, a little room service hop there, and then he pitches it. You practice this, coach. You practice this at practice many of the times. Not the fumble, but you practice pitching the ball to the man that's open, and these are the results. You don't practice this high step. Yes, you do. You do? Yeah, he may be in the top two. into the end zone. So Dallas is down 14-7 midway through the third quarter, but just when you thought they may have a hangover from that loss to New England, Terrell Owens holds on to the ball. Concentration. He had two feet in. He knew he was going to take a lick, Darren, but he hung on anyway. Darren Sharper providing the lick, and then Marion Barber, he usually licks the competition down on the goal line, and that's the first rushing touchdown allowed by Minnesota this season. Ties it at 14. Next possession for Minnesota. Here's Adrian Peterson. 15 yards down to the 31. And then it leads to this particular field goal that is blocked. It is blocked. Chris Canty blocks it. Pat Watkins picks it up. Florida State, come on, baby. You got to hold it up. You're only lambing back there. And he doesn't hold it up. He's disciplined. Yeah, he's going to be reprimanded for me. But he's in the end zone, though, as Wade Phillips. Yippee! 21 I love a coach who shows emotion. Dallas on, the field. on top, fourth quarter, and then the rookie puts the ball on the turf. A rare fumble by Adrian Peterson. Brady James recovers it, and Jason Hatcher, who had a uh, return for a score last week, is the one who reaches around and pokes it out. That led to a Nick Folk field goal as the Cowboys take a 10 point lead and win by those 10 points, holding Adrian Peterson to a season low 63 yards as Dallas has outscored opponents 149 to 74 in the second half, and they hit the bye week to six and one. Nice record hitting the bye week.